Hey, I know this isn't your regularly scheduled video, but Voodoo just came out of beta with a pretty big update, and I've seen basically nobody talking about it on YouTube, so I figured I'd capitalize on that absence. In case anyone watching doesn't know what Voodoo is, it's basically a mod for the PC version of a Township Tale that adds spells and magic to the game. Those spells include combat magic, item repairs, transmutations, and summoning spells of a large variety. A new, mysterious type of spell called Blood Magic is planned as the next school of magic, although we know basically nothing about it. All I can say for sure is to fear the Blood Mage. With that out of the way, what all was added in this update? Starting off small, five new spells were added to the mod that allows you to conjure trees. The main use that I can see for these Arbormancy spells comes from them being prepared spells, so you can set them up whenever and summon a tree at any time that you need wood. This could be especially useful in the mines, if you run out of fuel for your lanterns and you need to restock immediately. Also, depending on what the material cost is, you could potentially use this to get a bunch of wood quickly without having to go find that many trees to get that quantity of wood. Next is the spellbook reset. Simply put, the words and materials used to cast every spell in the entire mod have been changed, and now almost every spell is unknown to most users. So, I've done the work to compile a list of every currently discovered spell that I know of, as well as who discovered them. If you want to discover all the spells for yourself without getting any of them spoiled for you, skip to the timecode on screen. I'll be going over these in the order of when they were discovered, so the first ones will be first, and the last last ones will be last. First, Acid Bolt. Sliver of Salt, Salt. Skin of Worm, Green Leather Strips. Essence of Pyre, Fireworks. Seal. Second, Frost Bolt. Heart of Gems, Blue Crystal. Skin of Worm, Green Leather Strips. Essence of Pyre, Dynamite, and Tuft of Spriggle, Blue Feather. Third, Dart. Artifact of Terra, Goterra Seedling Orb, Tuft of Spriggle, Blue Feather, Skin of Terra, Oak Wedge, Seal. Fourth, Transmute Iron to Gold, Essence of Embers, Coal, Artifact of Earth, Iron Ingot, Heart of Gems, Blue Crystal, Seal. Fifth, Transmute Copper to Iron. Essence of Embers, Coal, Artifact of Earth, Copper Ingot, Heart of Gems, Blue Crystal, Seal. Sixth, Flask of Endless Water. Fluid of Silica, Flask of Water. Fluid of Produce, Ripe Blueberry, Seal. Seventh, Conjure Crystal Sword. Fragment of Weapon, Short Wooden Handle, Heart of Gems, Blue Crystal, Artifact of Earth, Palladium Ingot, Seal. Eighth, Smokescreen. Bonds of Silica, Empty Flask, Essence of Embers, Dried Grass, Seal. Ninth, Repair Copper Device. Heart of Weapon, the object you want to repair, Essence of Embers, Coal, Artifact of Earth, Copper Ingot, Fluid of Spriggle, Bone Shard. It's likely that these aren't the only spells that have been discovered by now, but they're the only ones I've seen people actually talk about the incantations for. The hunt for new spell recipes is still on, so join the official Voodoo Discord and help us out in the experimentation chat channel. Last, and certainly not least, are the dexterity settings. With these settings, you can choose which hand is your main casting hand, and you can choose if you want combat spells to come out of your palm or your finger. These changes are quality of life features that I've been asking for since basically the mod's creation, so it's nice to see them finally get implemented. It's especially useful if you, like me, want to be a spell sword, but don't want to have to either sheath your weapon to cast spells or become proficient with offhand sword fighting. Technically, left-handed people could always do this, but it's nice for us right-handed people to finally be able to. Overall, I'd say Voodoo's exit from beta and the 1.0.0 release have been great. 
and I'm looking forward to what comes next for this fantastic mod, especially with what I've heard of blood magic. As always, if you have a weapon you want me to review, the link to submit that is in the description. And, with all that said, I'll see you around.